Good day everyone, I am Hamdan Ismail Pisa Omay, Bachelor of Secondary Education, major in Mathematics. So I'm here right now to discuss the two documents of the result in the context of 90th century, which is by Sona Zaidi and Skomo Chur. Sona Zaidi are put some subtopic of this 90th century Philippines, which is the 11th subtopic. The first one is the history of colonial administration. The second is corruption, corruption of official dom. Number three is no Philippine representation in the Spanish courts. And number four is human rights denied to Filipinos. Number five is no equality before the law. And number six is maladministrations. And the number seven is racial discrimination or racism. Number eight is the bureaucracy. Number nine is Hacendas owned by the friars. Number ten is forced labor, and the last is the gorgeous civil. The subtopic of school mature in the 90th century Philippines is this five. Okay, so first is we have our economic development. Second is political development. The third is cultural development. The fourth is religious development. And number five, or the last subtopic, is the main current of the nationalist movement. So we, did, we have to compare and contrast these two documents, two versions of documents in the 19th, the, what's happening in the 19th century Philippines. Okay, so we see the brutal experience by our beloved brothers and sisters Filipinos. And we see also how the Spaniards are greedy or desperate or aggressive in such ruling our country with its uh, maladministrations of justice, with its uh, racism practices. So we are be thankful to the, especially to the Dr. results who initiate nationalist national movement or revolutions in order as to to have every year a independence day and an independence from the Spaniards colonizations. This 19th century discussions of the document by Sona Saidi and the Scombatures. It is so helpful for studying results works and that will be all. Thank you. Till next vlog.